Uh, Rafa, so if you could tell us about your first game, especially after just being finally signed right. with the Earthquakes and how it was, what was the experience like compared to playing for Loyola Marymount? Right. I think it's a different level. And it was exciting uh, we'll to finally now. come out of the field um, and maybe put my little, my part to the team. Uh, I know I've been <laughs> out for a while and I just got 10 minutes. But I think I'm really excited to be back. Um, it was really exciting to be in front of the crowd, getting received really well. I felt really, really comfortable. I felt really welcome. Did you expect to be out there today? or Because I knew you were on the. I saw you like make the bench right. and after just having been signed right. like yesterday. Right. So did you have any inkling that you're going to play today or you thought, okay, I'm just getting closer? Um, I did think I was going to play a few minutes. Um, not four or nine minutes I haven't been playing, but um, like I said, it was, it was exciting to be out there and be with these guys that I've been training for a while now. So what was it like when you saw um, Bush's ball all the way out to you and then you just took off running down mm -hmm. the corner. Oh, that was, I was like, all right, this is what I've been waiting for. I, I like, I like that, those kind of balls where I can go one-on-one -on -one with the defenders. So I thought I was going to be able to get to it. Um, like it bounced and then I couldn't really get it behind the ball. So uh, what, it, what are, who are some of the players that you've already kind of made a connection with to some degree? Uh, I think Simon, uh, he, had, he played really, really good on the ball. Um, Kari, Wando, um, and then RJ, the guys, Ramiro on the left. So, um, like I said, I think I fit really well with all the guys. I, I mean, I got to be with them for since February, so I kind of know how they play when they want the balls and everything. So from this first game, what are you now that you've had your first game under your belt? Right. What do you what do you uh, what are you gonna what have you learned from this game? I know there's only you know ten minutes, but like how, what are you gonna what are you gonna bring to the next game, or what have you learned that will help you next time? I think for me, just getting game fit. I haven't been able to play a lot of games. I was out for a month and a half. Doing all the paperwork and everything that had to be fixed, and so just that the game fit is the thing that's lacking right now. Um, before I left, I know I was playing with the with the reserves, and I feel really good. I think we played it. My, my last game that I played was against Santa Clara, and I feel really good. And I just um, I'm just gonna start working hard to get back into that that game fit that I, I had before I left. And once I get there, I'll be good. And uh, one last thing. So, what is the what is the player you most look forward to playing against in one of the MLS teams coming up? I think Landon Donovan. Landon Donovan. So why Landon Donovan? Because I think he's the one of the players that since I've grown up, um, I looked up to him just because he's a big part here in the United States. And he's the best player in the MLS and. He's demonstrated not only in the MLS but in the national team. He has on his part. I think it's really it's a privilege to play a player like that. Yeah, thank you, Rafa. You're welcome.